You come in and you go to work on those briefs of yours, and if I forget one little thing, you jump on me as if I were in the witness box. Oh, we used to laugh together at things, John, but now everything's deadly serious. I'm tired of it. So am I. But with regard to this memory of yours, would I be right in suggesting that your mind might be elsewhere than on your home? What does that mean? I may have many faults and one or two disabilities, but I am not blind. And I tell you here and now, I'm sick to death of that tame cat of yours hanging around this house. Who? Bill. John, you must be mad. You've known Bill for 20 years. And does the Bible tell us how long Uriah the Hittite knew David? For all I know, they may have been at school together. Are you accusing me of... Now, look here. You said you wanted to have a few things out. All right, let's have this one out. Is he or is he not in love with you? Yes, he is. Are you in love with him? Not yet. What do you mean, not yet? Exactly what I say, not yet. You realize you're on very dangerous ground. If you want our marriage to break up, you're going the right way about it. Where did you sleep? In the park. What park? Salisbury. In a shelter. But for heaven's sake, why? Because I knew you were coming here today to fetch my mother. But can't you understand I'm going to marry your mother? No, you're not! You're not going to take away our home! You're not going to make Jess any more beastly! You're not going to make Linda cry anymore. 